Hi, it's Ted East from Colony Outfitters in Colony Provincial Park, Ontario. I'm just going to run through a few tips on what to bring with you on a canoe trip. First, a decent portage pack with a good harness that is soft and flexible so you can lay it flat and tuck it underneath the thwarts in the canoe. A good silicone tarp for a sunfly and rain protection. A decent tent. To stay warm and dry in a canoe trip is most important. And one quick trip is to take your sleeping bag and twist it into a heavy duty garbage bag, squish the air out, and then knock it down into a, a small, concise, waterproof compression sack. Self-inflating air mattresses. To stay healthy, you need to drink clean water. This is the best system that we've found. A four liter bag of dirty water drops into a bag of, of four liters of clean water. Cooking is very important. This is our best choice, an MSR uh, Dragonfly stove. It takes white gas, is easy to use, but most important, it has a valve where you can control the cooking flame. A nesting stainless steel pot set, lightweight cutlery and plates, a trowel to do your business, make sure you dig a nice hole and bury it. Most important, a waterproof map case and a decent compass. Trust your compass, buy a good one, and you'll have less confusion when you think you're lost. For illumination, headlamps work awesome a good compact saw for firewood, and then perhaps most important, a good waterproof first aid kit. Thank you for looking at the gear that is important for a successful canoe trip. Just remember one thing, don't bring too much because you do have to carry it. Learn more paddling skills at paddlingmagazine.com. Watch The Canoe, an award-winning film that tells the story of Canada's connection to water and how Ontario is enriching the lives of those who paddle there. Visit canadiancanoeculture.ca.